You and your friends are f You're a hard man to find. Where are my manners? The name is Levy. Levy Dryden. Did Duncan ever mention me? Levy of the coins? Levy the trader? Really? He never told you of old Levy? We've known each other for years. But here I am carrying on while you have a blight to stop. Don't want to waste your time. But you see, Duncan promised that together we'd look into something important for the Wardens. And for me. But poor Duncan's. Well, no more. A tragedy it is, at that. But I know he would want his work carried on. His pledge fulfilled. My family... Well, past a bit checkered, to see. Nobles look at us with disdain. My great-great-grandmother, Sophia Dryden, was the last warden commander of Ferelden, back when the wardens were known as freeloaders. So King Arlen banished the Wardens, and he took House Dryden's land and titles. Duncan wanted to reclaim the old Grey Warden base, Soldier's Peak, and perhaps we'll uncover evidence to restore my family's honour along the way. Nobody's been to Soldier's Peak since the Grey Wardens were banished, but I found a way. They say it's haunted, and it's certainly dangerous. Will you help me? Darkspawn surfaced in southern Ferelden, and Duncan got plenty busy recruiting new wardens and meeting with good King Caelan. Duncan said he would help after the Battle of Ostagar. Said there might be useful things at the peak, but he never had the chance. A thousand blessings upon you, Warden. I'll mark down the location on your map. When you arrive, we'll pick our way through the tunnels together. Here we are. Soldier's Peak. Make us breath. Look at the size of her. What a fortress. I told you the map would get us through the tunnels. I wasn't lost, it's just that the map got soggy. Bah! We're here. So, I'll follow you about, from a distance. This place has the stench of death. I expect there's trouble up ahead. Fall back! Fall back already! Taking the peak will not be easy, my lord. I gave the Wardens one chance to die with honor. Instead, they hold up like cowards. We follow the King's advice, then. Starve them out. But the Peak has months of supplies. Then we wait. When they are too weak to lift their weapons, we will send them to their final judgment. Whoa, what was that? Felt a bit woozy there. I'm not mad, am I? You saw it too. Yes, Warden.
Men's morale is low. My spells are of no use in this matter, Commander. There is more to leading men than sorcery, Avernus. I will remind them that they're wardens. Men! I won't lie to you! The situation is grim. Our forces outnumbered, our bellies empty, and our hearts are sagging. But we are wardens! Darkspawn flee when they hear our horns! Archdemons die when they taste our blades. So are we to bend knee to a mere human despot? No! I, for one, will never give up! I, for one, will never surrender just to dance on Arlen's gallows. So I propose here and now, in these hallowed halls where generations of our brethren stood vigil against darkspawn and evil, that we send a message to that fat bastard. In this sacred place, proud men, strong men, stood defiant and would rather die than submit to tyranny. So brave, even when starving, and my great-great-grandmother stood with them. Not much is known of King Arland. The War of Succession that followed his death, now that was a piece of work, lasted nearly a decade and almost burned Denerim and the palace to the ground. Loads of history was lost, but maybe there's answers to that inside. But I've gabbed enough. Lead on, my friend.
shall be done. Almost done. The, the truth must be told. What does it matter? We're dead. Our grand rebellion so close. And to die here, a, a stillbirth. We never should have done it. Wardens aren't supposed to oppose kings and princes. Should we stand idly by? Another one? Rebellion? What's this about a rebellion? If only the book weren't burned. We can only hope. fighting.
the warden summoned demons. Can't believe it. And my grandmother, she knew. Of course, I'll stop my nattering then. Step no further, Warden. This one would speak with you. Because this peak is mine. This one is the Dryden, Commander, Sophia. <laughs> All these things. Grandmother? You have slain many of the demon ilk to get here. This one would propose a deal. The soldier's peak traps me. This one sees so many tantalizing places in the Dryden's memories. This one would see the world herself. For me to be free, into the old mage tower you go and destroy. In return, this one seals the veil. No more demons, no more enemies. Your peak would be safe. Just let this one go into the world. Yeah. Your kind likes gold, yes? This one knows of all hidden places. If you help, this knowledge is yours. Good, good. Nothing must live. Nash stone with teeth if you can. It has begun.
Day 32. The subject is not responding to the stimuli. Testing the pain threshold has uncovered nothing. Only three subjects are left. Day 82. If only I could reproduce last night's extraordinary success. Electricity is only a catalyst. The blood is the key. Day 97. Energy and blood. Repeated applications have duplicated the results. I conjecture that success can be induced alchemically. But there are no more subjects left. If only I had one more, or a dozen, the things I could do. I hear you. Don't disrupt my concentration. Even now the demons seek to replenish their numbers. Are you to thank for this welcomed but temporary imbalance? My body may be frail, but my sorcery is not. Maelstrom has subsided. The Magus's web is destroyed. This one remembers the deal. Come, follow. Gossamer strands only stand between this world and home. Feel it. So deliciously weak here. So frail. 
The entire world should be as such. But this one will feed the veil, make it strong. My brethren will not make it easy. Are you ready? Then we begin. be done. My brethren will not But this my brethren will not make it you keep the brethren away from me. This one will sow the s then. My brethren.
shall be done. Done. Your veil is strong. This one has kept its word. Now this one will go. There is much to do. In the Dryden's quarters, a stone on the wall, carefully concealed. It holds the gold this one promised. Our business is at an end. What? This one will grind your bones in my teeth. Soldier's Peak is safe again. A good thing you took care of that Avernus. A blood mage. In the Wardens. Common folk should never hear of that. Some still distrust Wardens, even in a blight. Crazy buggers. But there was no proof to redeem my family. For so long, I was focused on the past. On answers. But I think I would have been better off had I stayed at home. Enough of that, though. I find myself at a loss. You've got a whole fortress now. I suppose I should start plying my trade again. You know I'm no good in a fight, but I'm a fair trader if I do say so myself. My cousins have been looking for a safe place to store trade goods, and the peak will do nicely. Whatever the Drydens have to offer are yours, for a sizeable discount. As you say. This one has kept its word. Now this... That was not... This one has kept its word. Our business is at an end. You've done it, Warden. So, but there was no proof. This one has kept its word. It holds the gold this one promised. 
our business is... No proof to re You've got a whole fort. You're gathering it.
as you say. It shall be done. Very well. Do your father proud, my lord? Certainly. You do me great honor, my lord. As you say. 